What's up, Explorers of the Frontier? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Astroneer's Let's Play. Or Astroneer Let's Play. Uh, this is episode 6, and my guy is hyped to start a base on this planet or moon. I don't know. Is it a planet or a moon? I, 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 can't you tell by my head scratch? I don't know. Okay, so basically when I came to this planet, this, um... This planet was definitely uh, circling the planet I came from, but it looked like the, all the planets were circling the planet I came from. Next time I get into space, I'm going to look around and see if I can tell what's going on with the orbits. Uh, I'm going to call this a planet for now, uh, and we'll just call it a planet. So. Um, so as you can see right here, I went back to my original uh, starting planet. By the way, do these planets have names? Like, I, don't, I didn't notice any names, but I wasn't looking for them, so I might have missed it. If they don't have names, we should name these planets. But anyway, um, I went back to my uh, starter planet, and I went ahead and got all the resources I could carry. Mostly copper, because copper is the one resource I can't get on this planet. Um, I also brought back some uh, organic, um, so I can maybe use that to power some of, the stuff's on, some of the stuff on this base if I need to. And uh, you guys gave me some cool tips in the comment field. Um, Creek Valier uh, basically told me that... You get research the first time you research a previously unresearched style of research pod based on shape and color, okay? That's kind of what I thought was the case. Now, the problem is I'm not going to remember what I researched and what I didn't. So I'm just going to grab all research things and just whatever, and we'll just research. I mean, it's pretty cool to get the to get the items from the research anyway, even if I've already researched what I what I brought back, because uh, it's, it's pretty good for trade. And uh, also someone told me, it might be the same commenter actually, uh, told me that... Uh, Lithium is always useful for batteries. However, titanium, while useful for, for while use for while useful for some other things, um, it, you don't need a bunch of them. So if you're going to trade anything, trade titanium. Also, filters and power cells. I was a little confused on how these work. Um, I actually went to first of all, um, a couple of you guys told me, but Ace Asington uh, was the one I picked out. Um, just random. Uh, basically, he said the the filters just store oxygen. They don't protect you from any gas, which is. I find kind of weird. Um, maybe in the future they'll change that. I don't know. Um, and then I went on the uh, I went on the wiki to double check, and yeah, sure enough, the 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 filters are just a little bit more oxygen. I don't get that. Um, so whatever. The same thing with the power cells. They're just extra power. They're basically. I went to the wiki to check it out. Uh, power cells. When equipped on a player, building, or vehicle, they create power for a limited time and disappear. So, you know, uh, whatever. The more you know, right? Okay, so. Let's get this base started. We're going to go ahead and first make the printer. We've already got the copper right here. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a printer. And what do we need next? Honestly, what I need on this plate, what I need on this planet is research, a research thingy and a vehicle bay. Honestly, I kind of need the vehicle bay more. Um, so let's, yeah, that's not going to help us here. Uh, well, we're going to need the one seater and we're going to need the solar panel probably. But for now, let's make the vehicle bay. And we'll make the vehicle bay right over here. Bring this out. Do we have any resin on us? We do not. All right, so let's go grab some resin. Uh, oh, you know what? I don't see. Any, I only have one or two resins, so that's not gonna be enough for the vehicle bay anyway. Um, but that's okay. So throw a thing of resin on there, and we're gonna bring the vehicle bay out over this way. A little bit more. Yeah, that should work. How's that? That looks good. Uh, put it on there. I did get two. Oh, I didn't take the other resin. Let me grab that. We're going to have to go get some more resin after this. Okay. And we're going to put resin on that and make the vehicle bay right there. It looks like a pretty good place for a vehicle bay. Um, let's go ahead and drop off some materials here and go get some resin. All right, guys, I'm back. I got the resin I needed, so we're going to go ahead and put this down right here. And we're going to make ourselves a vehicle bay, hopefully. Alright, so... That's the printer. Research. Ooh, we should make research, too. I think the vehicle bay is more important. Uh, getting around is going to be more important. So we do need aluminum. Unfortunately, I did not bring down any aluminum. Or I, if I did, I didn't bring down a lot. I don't think I brought down any aluminum, actually. We can get aluminum here. Alright, let's go get some aluminum. Oh, by the way, I kind of redid this. and Made, like, a little kind of like walkway to get down here a little easier and also as i'm using this uh this tool my batteries are draining now they seem to be coming back they're not coming back at all see that's not filling and i have power in my inventory and as far as i understand having power in your inventory should fill this up and it's not so i'm not sure why actually that's not filling up at all 
It's kind of weird. Um, usually, well, I, maybe this battery doesn't fill up. I know this one will fill up by itself, no matter what. Because it was happening to me uh, earlier when I was down in the pit. But, um, yeah, so, I'm not really sure what's up with that. Let's take a look at some aluminum. Is that aluminum? Uh, yes, it is. Cool. Nice and close, too. Oh, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Got room for one more. We're only gonna need two for this, uh, for the vehicle bay, but that's okay. Can always use more aluminum. Alright. So I'm trying to get too much. There we go. Alright, so as you can see right here, power is coming back, but it's being used by my solar panel. If I take my solar panel off, the power is still coming back, even though I'm not connected to anything. Okay, so that's kind of weird. Um, also, the power is coming. The power is coming back very slowly, but the, this, these power nodes are not being used. I am not really sure how the power nodes work. Someone told me something about the power nodes will power you if nothing else is powering you, or something like that, or if like a, a stronger source isn't powering you. But you saw like nothing was powering me, and it still wasn't powering the battery or the backpack even. So I'm not sure what's up with that power stuff. We'll have to. I'm not sure if it's, I'm probably just using it wrong because I, I did some research like looking for people who are having problems with it and nobody else having problems with it. It's just me, at least that I can tell. So obviously I'm just not understanding the way it works. All right, let's put these up there and go ahead. And what we're going to do is we're going to pick up the organics and the aluminum. And this thing needs power. It's not getting any. Let's put some of these power nodes on here. Okay, see, these aren't working at all. They're not doing anything. What am I doing wrong here? The, look, this is getting no power from anywhere. This power node is on the machine. Should be giving it power. It's not doing anything. So, let me know if I'm wrong, but it seems a little bit weird to me. Okay, so, vehicle bay. Let's do this. There we go. And make the vehicle bay. Now, I think all we're going to need for this is... Uh, what do you call it for the vehicle bay? I think the only thing we're going to need for the vehicle bay is compounds. So let's grab some of these power things and put it on the vehicle bay and see if it'll get any power. Okay, power nodes. Nope, not doing anything. And I've seen these power nodes work before. So I'm really, really just confused here. Now I'm stuck with no power and no way to get power. I think what we're going to have to do now is we're going to have to make a solar panel before we do anything else. Alright, so let's go ahead and make a solar panel. Compound? We don't have any compound. Alright, let's go get some compound. Um, another thing that's weird is when I went... Let's drop off some of the stuff I don't need. I'll put it right here. Uh, I might want that down there. Don't need this. And that's it. Another weird thing is when I stopped my game and came back, all of the enemies below respawn. Which I find really, really irritating. <laughs> I clear out this whole freaking cave and everything's respawned. Now, I don't know if that's a gameplay feature or if that was a mistake. I don't know, but it kind of sucks. Um, early access, guys. This game is not even in alpha. This game is in pre-alpha. So, we're going to have to be aware of those things. But, even though I'm aware of those things and I understand them and it's acceptable and I'm okay with it, it still sucks. Right there. There we go. I don't know. I guess I just get. I guess you get power automatically. I guess they don't want to ever put you in a point in the game where you're you don't have any power at all, because then it could like destroy your game. I guess. So they probably give you power back no matter what at some point. All right. So is that good? But we, yeah, we're having some real issues here. All right. How much did we get? Okay, we got enough for one. We gotta find another one. Uh. Yeah, let's go get another one. Shouldn't be a problem. Alright. Alrighty then. We gotta be careful because, like I said, everything respawned. See, look at these sons of bitches. So, I think if I suck up that power on the ground, I will get power for it. So. It seems like when I'm in the act, when I'm in the act of, like, sucking things up, that the power does work for me. See, look at that. That worked. Now we've got a lot of power. 
And we're looking. So, okay. All the mobs respawn, but the um, the resources didn't respawn. I got a problem with that. <laughs> if you're going to have the mobs respawn, make the resources respawn. It might be a bug. I'm not sure. Oh, is this the end of the cave? Is it going up? I don't think I've ever come down this way, actually. There we go. Don't touch anything. Oh god, I didn't realize I'm not putting down my things. God, hold on, man. We're really looking bad here. Hold on. Oof. I forgot to put down any of those tethers. So do these things still hurt you even when they're down? Or am I getting hit by the little ones? No, they, they don't hurt you when they're down. I must be getting hit by the little ones. Okay, that's slightly irritating. Take care of their asses. That's right. You're all going down now. You done messed up. <clears throat> you know what I'm wondering about those power, these power nodes right here? I'm wondering if they stop working once you log off and come back. That might be the case, actually. I wonder. Okay, let's do this. Alright, so the little ones are definitely hurting us, but when we knock the big, when we knock them on the ground, they don't hurt us anymore, right? Yes, that is the case. For some reason, I didn't, th I didn't think... Oh, boy. Just got one-shotted. Man, I don't even know who the heck killed me. Alright. Take that. Put it right there. We could probably just shift-click, right? There we go. I'm gonna leave some of this power stuff there, because I don't really need it. I'll just throw it on the ground. Okay. So get out of there. Get out of there, man. Seriously, get out of the bag, bro. Sheesh. <clears throat> okay. Man, I'm really not paying attention to the tethers. I don't know why I'm doing that. <laughs> I, gotta, I, I haven't played this game in like a few days. So, I'm doing holiday stuff, so didn't really get much time to play. Wow. <sighs> Is there a... I think, I, I think once you defeat these creatures, they need to stay defeated. I don't know if that's a bug. It's probably a bug. But, like, when I come in and clear out a cave, next time I go in, it should be cleared out. Um, I'm not sure. That, that was gas, so that was definitely one of those gas plants. So. Not doing too good today, guys. Not doing too good. You know, that's what happens. You don't play a game for a couple days, you know. Do the holiday stuff, the Christmas stuff, and you come back, and all of a sudden, you're, uh, you're noobified. hurting yourself plenty of other things here to hurt you dude can we um can we bring this up and bury these or something because it's really irritating having to come through all this all right let's keep a lookout for gas i don't know maybe when i killed that one plant it was just gas i don't know there we go all right take this and this and this and this and this and escape? How do I click out of that? There we go. Alright. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was gas from them. Okay. Alright. Alright, good to know. Good to know. Looks like we're getting a lot of good research pods around here too, which is nice. Uh, what is going on here? Put the freaking thing down. I didn't want to pick that up. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make a little walkway on the side because <laughs> this is just irritating trying to walk through here just destroy everything right in the middle get you down there there we go 
All right, looking better. Looking better here. Wonder what's up here. I know it's just coming up to the surface. I'm just kind of curious if there's anything up here interesting. Oh, okay. Nothing much. It's over this ridge. It's over here. Take a look really quick. It's pretty interesting. Nothing in there? I find that hard to believe. I guess not. Probably nothing in there. Who knows, right, people? Let's just get back to our little cave system over here. What the heck were you looking for in here anyway? I got totally sidetracked. Oh, you know what we're looking for? Compound. Right? Is that what we're looking for? No, we needed to make the solar panels. What was the solar panels taking? I think it's compound, actually. I don't know. I'm going to get compound. This is like a minefield in here. Jesus. Okay. Okay. Oh, boy. All these things respawned. I only see... Let's go down this way. There might be compound down here. Alright, guys. Got the sol got the compound for the solar panel. And, um, you know, I'm so worried about this vehicle bay. That was a mistake. First of all, there's not enough compound on this, on this planet to, you know, keep anything going. It's very, very difficult to keep stuff going on this, to, to make anything on this planet, because there's, there is compound, it just doesn't seem like there's a lot. So, instead of making the vehicle bay, what I should have done was I should have made a damn trade station. That's what I should have did, that was a mistake. Um, so I'm going to be working on the trade station now, let's see if we can get some resin. And, um, yeah, the enemies uh, spawning back is making this whole area down here look like Swiss cheese. But um, we're going to see what we can do. We're going to see what we can do, we should be able to get some resin relatively easy let's go down this way let's see what we got oh yeah there's resin okay all right let's grab some of this resin we only need one more piece so that shouldn't take long i'm not even gonna cut the video for it there we go nope i spoke too soon there we go oh, oh, there we go <laughs> i thought i spoke too soon again okay so let's get up there let's do some trade you know if you come on a new planet honestly i think the trade station is probably your best bet um you know because there's just there's just not enough compound on this planet that I can see. I mean, I haven't explored the caves a lot, but, you know, I've explored them enough to know there's not a lot of compound in the areas I've already been to. So, let's go ahead and do that. And let's turn this place into a trade platform. We're going to need aluminum. Okay. So, we got to go get that aluminum again. Let's do it. We know where it is. All right, guys. Trade platform is complete. The only problem is now is I don't know what I want to trade. I guess we can trade some uh, some organic. I mean, I don't know. Uh, with all the power nodes underground, I don't really need a lot of organic. So let's go ahead and trade that. Can we get it? We can't get any compound for one. We can get one compound for two. Um, can we trade built items? Can we trade this? Oh. So we can trade um, built items, but we don't seem to get anything for it. Yeah, that's weird. All right, well, then we won't trade it. Alright, uh, one compound, that's not going to be enough. I don't want to trade copper. Uh, well, another one of these isn't going to do much. Um, let's go exploring, see if we can find that titanium. I know there's titanium out here. Um, I'm trying hard not to put down tethers, because apparently tethers will cause lag, and I'm going to have a vehicle relatively soon, so there's no point in doing that. Let's come out and explore this thing. I don't know what this thing's all about. Can we do anything with this? Oh, research. Cool. All right, we'll leave it where it is then. Come back and get it once we've got a research thingy. All right. Uh, resin. Oh, what the hell? That's a big freaking pit. All right, let's get back. We've got some oxygen concerns. I really don't want to put down any tethers, but I, I might have to. I guess we could just pick them back up. We don't have a lot on us anyway. Um, that kind of sucks because I don't want to make more. <laughs> All right, so should we sell the aluminum? Or trade the aluminum? I don't know. There's titanium up here. I'd rather trade the titanium. Let's see if we can find the titanium. I know I found titanium. I did it off camera, though. Let me see if I can find it again. Man, I finally found the titanium. It took forever. 
we do not have a lot of oxygen. Let's get back and get some oxygen. And then I'll show you where the, you could kind of tell where the titanium is. Um, within regards to my base. I think one piece of titanium will probably get us the, the compound we're going to need for the vehicle. And I cannot wait to have a vehicle because this sucks. Run around on a planet like, man, I've almost like... I've almost died of, asphy of asphyxiation a couple times. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, so let's put this right here. No, that's not good. I'm going to put it right there. Then we're going to grab you and grab you. Kind of get these guys over to that titanium. Or at least as close to it as possible. Alright, there we go. Now, there's much easier ways I could have done this. I'm just trying to be efficient. So, no, oh, oh. That was weird. Um, yeah, I'm just tr I'm just trying to be efficient with the way I'm doing things. So, you know, it's all right. Yeah, I cut the boring parts out for you guys. So, I was running around for a good 15, 20 minutes looking for this stuff. It was right over here. And it's funny, when I looked at it, I thought it was, like, copper or something for some reason. I don't know why I didn't... Oh, is it on something I can't mine? Oh, what the hell? Seriously? That's on something I can't mine, people. What's up with that? I didn't know there was something I couldn't mine in the game. Can anyone explain to me, like, how to get around that, or... Alright, guys, so here we go. Let's, uh... Let's put the titanium... Should we put the... Let's take these down and just put the titanium up. Let's see what we get for one titanium. Oh, look at that. One titanium is four compound. Alright. Let's just get a bunch of compound. Go! Bring me back compound. Very good, very good. So we will have the rover today, so that's good. I'm very happy about that. All right, that is awesome. Okay, so this is a printer. What do we make next? Storage, wind turbine, battery, generator, habitat. Oh, we're gonna need a seat thing. Oh, so we're actually gonna need a little bit more. Well, we're getting eight compound back, so that should be fine. Uh, yeah, cool, cool. All right, yeah, we need a lot of compound, man. Like, <laughs> a lot of compound. I don't know what to do on the, this moon or pl planet. I'm going to call this a planet. I don't know what to do on this barren planet. Um, once I get the rover, I'm going to look around. But I, I think we'll be probably moving on pretty soon. I just want to make bases everywhere. It's freaking cool. All right. So we need to remove some items from our thingamabob here because it's in the way. That I'm gonna sell the organic. I don't with all the power nodes underground and like okay, so here's my theory with the power nodes. I think when I, either I'm using them wrong uh, incorrectly, or uh, or either I'm using the power nodes incorrectly, or uh, they once you leave and come back, they're bugged. Either way, I'm I, you know it could it's one of those two. All right, so let's go ahead and make this bad boy. Go for it. We need two more for the seat. Oops. Come on. Get the papa. There you go. Alright, so I didn't get eight compound though, did I? Oh yeah, I did. Because I just put four in there. I didn't have any on me. I don't think I had any on me. Let's well, two, four, six, eight. Yeah, I got eight. Okay. Cool, cool. Let's get rid of this crap for some more compound. Uh, there you go. Give me some compound. And then we're going to come over here where you're going to make the seat and then we're after that we're gonna make should I just get rid of this power I think this power is just bugged and taking up room I didn't seem to be doing anything I don't know like I said if I'm using it wrong let me know but I, I think it's kind of messed up all right so let's put this right here and then we're gonna go ahead and make a storage container and that is all the compound we just got so eight compound but well worth it. Well worth it. Put that on there. There we go. Some more compound. Oh, you know what else we're going to need for that? We're going to need... Um, actually, before we do anything, I kind of want a research platform here. There we go. Looking good, looking good. All right, before we need, before oh, and with a vehicle bay, I think I can now land my spaceship 
here on the vehicle bay. Like, if I want to come back to this planet, I think I can land on the vehicle bay now, which is pretty cool. All right, so let's come on over here. I think this is a pretty good spot. Let's move this out of the way. And let's come right here. Let's, uh, do we have resin? I don't know if we have resin. All right, I think that's going to be it for us today because I don't see any resin. I'll go down and get some resin for sure in between videos. All right, guys, I think we're going to call this one here. That is going to be it for episode six. Next episode, uh... I think we're going to be on this planet for one more episode and uh, continue. I want to get this research thing built, and I want to research these these uh, items before I move on to another planet. Uh, so we'll be here at least one more episode. Maybe only one more episode. We'll see. Anyway, that is going to do it for episode six. We'll see you next time for episode seven. Till then, take it easy.